From a village where electricity is unreliable and internet is scarce, Malungelo Matonzi and Marvel Shubambu have developed a free e-learning app to help rural learners in grade 8 to 12 access quality education. Through lived experiences, so having to grow up um, on a rural environment where you do not have access to high quality education, for me myself having to travel for two hours to access high quality education, I saw the need. When I was in grade 12, I remember having to, there was a very big gap between myself and my classmates and I started to realize that the problem is not that I am so smart and they are not as smart it's because they don't have access to high quality education and the best way to bring education to people it is through smartphones right uh, everyone have a smartphone you have a smartphone they had smartphones so developing an app seemed like a, a more efficient and easiest way to actually get education into people's uh, into people's lives basically with no formal training and limited resources, Matonzi and Shubambu taught themselves to code using YouTube tutorials. They say one of their major challenges was working with outdated equipment and unreliable internet connectivity, which made the development process difficult. We're coming from a village named Gumbani village. Uh, this village is less privileged to, to tech and internet connections. So the, 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 the problems that we encountered when we were developing the app is the power cards and the low internet connections. Initially, we had no computer to start developing the Nova app, so we had to gather some monies from our own packed pockets so that we can start developing this platform. The app offers a range of educational resources, including lessons in mathematics and science. Despite a number of hurdles that the two innovators encountered, Nova has seen remarkable success with over 50,000 downloads in just five months. Their breakthrough came when a video about their work went viral on TikTok, drawing nationwide attention. A number of companies have since approached the two. So when they saw us after Cool Story Brew actually published our story and he wanted people to actually have access to us, Liberty actually called us and they actually say, hey, we know what you're trying to do. We are on the very same mission and through you guys, we want to work with you to ensure that you get to where you want to go. The duo's journey from a small village to national recognition underscores the transformative power of determination and innovation. If you really want to do something in life, just start with whatever that you have. You are not going to get time where you're going to say, this is the right time for me to start doing something. With what you have, you can start doing something. Their platform aims to deliver more than 1,000 hours of interactive lessons, including live tutorials for over 10,000 rural students. Yulisan Jamela for CGTN in Johannesburg, South Africa.